She told her parents something was in her room, but as they look through the toy camera, they see it. User Charity Lewis uploaded a horrifying video captured by her younger sister's toy camera, where she explains that while going through her camera, she found this disturbing video that left her and the family speechless. Hey guys, today I'm going to show you my Skibbity Toilet Collection that I just got today. Um, we went to a toy store and they had all of these things like this camera, these tiny little action figures, this big Skibbity Toilet, and this one. And then, yeah, I was really happy and I was yummy. And, um, I have, I... Um, I saw my friend the other day, and we went on a walk, and we also got ice cream that day, and I'm having a lot of fun. Something off camera paralyzed her in fear, but as she runs out of the room, they see it. A shadow can be seen exiting her room, almost as if this thing is following her. Lewis and the family uploaded the video on their personal page, looking for answers. Oh my fucking god, I swear to god, this thing just fucking looked at me, oh my fucking... She was just trying to sleep when something tried to get in. Mega Barles woke up in the middle of the night to the sounds of an unknown creature growling outside her house. explains that ever since she became pregnant, this terrifying creature began appearing at night, even trying to open the doors to get in. May believes it's a type of Aswang, a shape-shifting evil creature from Filipino folklore, and in this case it is believed to be the Mananango, a creature that preys on sleeping pregnant women, using an elongated proboscis-like tongue to suck out fetuses. This nightmare continued every night, only getting worse with each passing day, only ceasing after her son was born, which further convinces her that the Aswang was responsible. But as always, let me know your thoughts on she this She was laying on her bed looking at her phone when she sees this. A woman named Cardina was just laying on her bed looking at her phone when she begins to feel like someone's watching her. Scared to turn around by the thought of someone standing behind her, she turns on her front phone's camera and captures this. As Cardino begins to record, a loud noise can be heard behind her. She explains that the sound heard in the video was one of her plant pots that had mysteriously fallen. So could it be that something paranormal was watching her from that closet? Let 
we know what you think. Well, I guess that's one way of communicating. Sounds like she was on the other side of the door doing this stuff. Okay, I'm gonna go down here probably against my better judgment. But Madeline, I want I want to talk with you. You're making a lot of noise. Is there anything that I can do to help you to where you're not as noisy anymore? Hmm? Hmm? Whoa. Madeline, are you trying to play a prank on me? What are you doing? Whoa, did you see that? Whoa. Whoa. She ran through that damn door. That's crazy. Madeline, you up here? Okay, the clock's on the floor. She doesn't like time, I don't guess. Madeline, you here? Can you show yourself? Can you show yourself to the camera? Hmm? Can you? Can you show yourself to the camera? Madeline, are you here? Whoa! More book stacking I see here. stuff going on. Oh, okay. That was weird. Alexa, what's your favorite joke? Alexa, what's the nearest gun range? It's late at night when a group of friends decide to visit their school to do something that they would later come to regret. Rumor has it that the school they attend is haunted. According to some students, if you knock on the door of the nurse's office, which is located at the back of the school, someone or something would knock back. Not sure if the rumors were true and feeling adventurous, a girl named Devi and her friends set out to explore the back of their school and knock on the nurse's door. But what they capture sends them running in a panic frenzy. This is what they caught. Go. Just knock on it. Not, not, go. Knock harder. Let them know. Um. Out of nowhere, a blood-curdling scream is caught on camera, sending the girls running in full terror. They have no idea where the guttural screams came from, but one could only guess the source of the screech. Viewers believe that it came from either inside the school or near it, which only helps to prove the rumors as true. Something haunts this school. But of course, what's your stance on this? Supernatural or something else? You let me know. She appears to feed from his fear, devoid of any features. This dark and sinister entity hell-bent on making his life a misery. Weird stuff tonight. A lot of bangs and thuds and they've been over in this area and this is the area the ghost girl was in last time but maybe yeah I can get them on tape not expecting much of anything else but I mean just weird creepy bangs 
right now she's at work here by myself this ghost seems to like to terrify me more than anything else but but anyway let's see if I can catch any of this see how long it actually takes because it seems to be occurring like every like two or three minutes <laughs> It's like it's either going from upstairs or the door, and the door freaks me out. There's no way here. God. That is crazy. You gonna do anything else? More bangs? Huh? I guess that's it. Just wanted to scare the Do you believe in the Hatman? He doesn't just appear during sleep paralysis. He can appear at any time, day or night. Who is he though, the Hatman, is an observer, a protagonist, something that drives your nightmares. But don't fear him, it's what feeds his manifestation. The less you fear, the weaker he becomes, and eventually he will give up on you. So, right about here? Yeah, I mean, they would have had to use flash, unless the laser grid was lighting it up enough. Here's you with the flash. And what's interesting is you don't get any reflection off of the, that glass back there. But I mean, even that shadow of the original picture, it didn't have like a shadow here. It seems very quiet. But I'm not buying it. It's one of those quiets to me. Like, I don't feel like it's... Did you just see something? Yeah. What did you see? I saw that look in your eye. Yeah, something darted. Did you run the bar here? Uh, yeah. It sounded like a woman. What would you do if you were in the forest and hear these otherworldly ghastly screams getting closer and closer to you? A wendigo is near, and it's coming closer to you. It wants your soul. Would you stay and investigate further, or do the right thing and get out of there before it catches up with you? That wendigo is back. My, let's go. You guys seeing this shit? Hey! Looks like he wants to fight me. Damn, it disappears. Gotta be an alien. What do you guys think? Why is he disappearing like that? 